Hello everyone. So in this tutorial, we are going to continue our discussion on subqueries. Uh, in this video, we will majorly focus on using subqueries along with group by and having clauses. So let's start with it. We'll see the first question. Per job, how many employees are present in Delhi? So now since it is asked, it is we have to find per job. So we need to group the result per on the basis of designation. So there are around four designations available. We want to get per job the number of employees present. So if we for the timing, we just uh, do not consider this condition that is the employees from Delhi, then the query will be select designation comma we want the number of employees present so count star from EMP and then group by designation So we have four designations and count of each. But now what we want, we want to get the number of only those employees those are present in Delhi. So if you see in Delhi, so department number is 20. So from 20, there are only two designations or two people work over here. That is clerk and manager. So as we know, the where clause will get executed first. So our final result will include only manager count as one and only clerk count as one. President, salesman will not be considered because those records will be get filtered out in a have, uh, where clause. So, so the condition will be where DPT number is equals to. We know the department number for Delhi is twenty. Yes, we get the result. But what we want, we do not want the department the condition is not on the basis of department number but it is on the basis of the location that is delhi so we need a inner query that will give us the department number so where here we'll have a select query select d e p t n o from d e p t where l o c is equals to Delhi. For this query, it will give the result. But since we know that for in location Delhi, there can be multiple departments available, so the better practice would be instead of using equal to clause, we'll be using uh, in operator. Yes, we still get the result, same result. So we'll move ahead for the next question. Per job, how many employees of sales department earn more than 10,000? So first of all, we have to filter out the employees who earn more than 10,000. So there are only three records possible. That is manager, president and another manager. Now from these, how many of you are from sales department? We have 10, 30 and 20. Sales department that is 10. So final answer will only include the record number two let's see and the count will be one so select designation comma count star from EMP where we want earning more than 10,000 so where sal greater than 10,000 and they have to be from sales department Sales department we cannot query directly, so we need a subquery over here. So sales of department number 10 and department number 10 should match. So and department number is equals to instead of is equals to we'll use in clause a subquery that will have a select a p t department number from p t where d name is equals to sales. Okay, and we want the result per job, so we'll have group by designation. Hmm. 
yes it has to be the PTNO there is some mm, DPTNO yes so we get the result that is only one record that satisfy all the conditions so if we group by it the count is again one we'll move forward in the next question so we need to list the jobs in the ascending order of employees so designation and their number of employees i guess this itself should suffice control c so in this query we'll get the list of all designations and the number of employees in it now what we want to do is we want to list them in the ascending order of the number of employees so here by default they are ascended uh, they are in ascending order so let's do it in a descending order so order by count star dsc okay so as we know the order by clause is executed at the end so that is the reason why this column names can be specified over here even the allies name can be specified or simply we can specify the column position that is number 2 yes we still get the same result next question we need in the ascending order of number of employees so obviously this will be there order by 2 we need to list the jobs which at least have two employees from delhi so we have a condition that the count has to be at least 2 so after group by clause we need to have a having count of star greater than or equal to 2 and the employee has to be from Delhi so we will have a subquery over here where is equals to select okay so the query is correct but this will not return any result because if we have included a where clause from delhi then only records that is of department number 20 will be considered so first three records are initially filtered out from this uh, we are group we are grouping it by a designation so there will be two groups of one of clerk and one of manager in both cases the count will be one and since we have included a having clause having count greater than or equal to 2 there is no record that satisfies the count condition so this is a valid query but will result no records so if we just specify one over here then we must get two records one for clerk and one for manager okay so we'll stop today for this tutorial right now in the next tutorial, we'll continue with some advanced subqueries and then in later tutorials, we'll move on for joins. So stay tuned and happy learning.